going to have a look at minerals and the importance of minerals. It's something that I feel passionate about. The latest scientific research tells us we should live in good health to 120. That's actually our potential. Why isn't this so? There's a number of reasons. The government's own statistics show that there is a shortfall in the nutrition that we get in our food today. 80 years ago, there was up to double the minerals in the soil than there is now. In 1992, at the World Summit in Rio de Janeiro, the world's leaders agreed there were 76% less essential minerals in the soil in Europe than 100 years ago. All this is a combination of farming methods leading to soil exhaustion and food processing, and we're eating less vegetables. The human body needs 40 minerals to function properly, but in modern farming, a mere three are added to the soil. In 1988, the Surgeon General in America said that 15 out of every 21 deaths involve nutrition deficiencies. And Linus Pauling, the only man ever to win two Nobel Prizes, one for his work on vitamin C, said all sickness, all diseases can be traced back to a mineral deficiency. Minerals are more important than vitamins in one sense. We really do need them. Some of the ways of getting minerals, because in 2002 the American Medical Association said everyone, whether they were ill or well, would benefit from taking a multivitamin and mineral. So you can get them in a variety of ways in supplements. Kelp comes from obviously seaweed is very good. A good multi with plenty of minerals, make sure it's got a good wide spectrum of minerals in it. And these days you can get ones that are very close to nature. They're called whole food minerals, where the minerals are grown into the growing broccoli or brassica plant. So when the plant's fully grown, it's harvested, dried, powdered, put into a vegan capsule, and you're getting essentially uh, minerals in a very concentrated form. So for me, every time, the key for looking after yourself for the future is to make sure you get plenty of minerals.